Sandokan is reunited with his friends and recovers his memory in Fu Qian's stronghold. When Fu Qian and the White Raja attack the monks of the mountains, Sandokan comes to the rescue. The Moving Forest. Fukien's red dragons are coming up through the forest. They'll attack the monastery. What? What? We must escape! They'll kill us all! Fleeing is for cowards. Have you perhaps forgotten the words of our master? He entrusted the monastery to us so that we might defend it. When Fukien arrives, he will find us ready for him. if the road was dry. <coughs> but in these conditions, it is hard to make predictions. What's the matter? Are you afraid your precious monks will flee to the hills? <laughs> At this moment, those shaven heads are saying their last prayers. Those monks are far more dangerous than you think, as you will soon find out, Roger. Ha! Ha! It is hard to explain Tai Chi energy. When you feel it, you will understand. Then tell me how I can learn to feel it. Gather yourself into the very center of your body. The ancient Chinese call it Tian Tan. Uh, I don't feel a thing. It requires a lot of practice. Oh. Shortcut, did he say? <laughs> We've been trekking through these mountains for hours on end, and still no sign of that monastery. Have faith, little brother. Chen Yu knows what he's doing. Do you really think that that wizened old man... Huh?
Master, what's wrong? The monastery is very near, but before we get there, we must eliminate the fat man who does not speak. Matty! He has been following us for many hours, but now his journey has come to an end. Here he comes now. Do you wish to take care of this problem, Mr. Yaddis? You can count on it. I have an account to settle with that tub of lard. <laughs> now to have some fun. <laughs> hey, little bull pig, looking for your sheep? <laughs> I'm gonna cut you down to size! <laughs> Nobody treats my friend that way and gets away with it. <laughs> you have learned your lesson well, Sandokan. I will show you Tai Chi. Incredible, Yanis. It's Tai Chi. You still think I am a wizened old man? I owe you an apology. That's the most amazing thing I've ever seen. There is the monastery of the fighting monks. You know, it's too bad their master's no longer with them. I would have given anything to meet him. Life is full of surprises. Master, we're here. I don't believe it. He's here. He's here. It is a great honor to have you here with us once again, Master. Huh? You mean you? When the wolf approaches, the shepherd returns to protect his flock. But first, the shepherd will rest and take sustenance from a cup of tea. Side I was looking for. The monastery is down there. Oh, what? I'll wager they're behind locked doors in there, quaking in their boots. They go barefoot and they're much cleverer than you give them credit for. We'd better send out scouts. I don't 
trust this apparent inactivity. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Very good indeed. Now the swallow must return to its nest to tell the other fledglings of his strange adventure. Shut the gate. Curses! I knew they were not to be trusted! Where are other dragons? Oh, captured by that oh. old man, Chen Hu, and Sandokan. Sandokan? Chen Yu must have led him to the monastery. Now the master is with his monks once again. The first four are taken care of. Mm, thank you, my dear. Our enemy is now very angry. Soon he will come back in full force to destroy the monastery. But anger will make him kill us, which we will profit by. Get those cauldrons ready! To the attack! Attack! If Wash Day continues, soon red dragons will become <laughs> white dragons. Come on up, friends. We're waiting for you. I'll tear you apart! <laughs> Like good teamwork, little brother. They know how to defend themselves. Catch them. Well, it's obvious that we'll never get in over the walls. Wise men say, if at first you don't succeed, try knocking on main gate. I'd say they bit off more than they could chew. That'll teach them to attack a peaceful monastery. Defeat always looks when least expected. <gasps> Won't stop it for much longer. And it is best we let them in. Open up. certainly taught them a lesson, thanks to you. You did a good job too, Santo Camp. We have many symbols on our standard now. But they will be back tomorrow, greatly strengthened. Would it not be wise to seek refuge higher up the mountain? To flee while battle is underway is worse than admitting defeat. Your men are incompetent. I told you those monks are smarter than the devil. That's enough. I am assuming command. We attack at dawn, and tomorrow, the monastery will be ours. Do you think we can hold out, dearest? Don't worry. Never say die, Marianne. 
Well, Chen Yu doesn't seem to be worrying about it too much. Remember, your body must always be in a circle. Like this? Imagine a serpent fighting an eagle. Can you see the serpent? Now I can. What is it doing? Moving back and forth within the same circle. And tonight we will do the same against the Red Dragon Army. Huh? We will move out and we will move back. And all they will see is a moving forest. Away. You will collect their weapons. Quit chattering and saddle the horses. We're going to ride against those monks. We don't have to go to them. They've come to us. <sighs> the monks. They must have gone mad. They're challenging us without weapons. And you've been trying to tell me how clever they are. We'll simply... Huh? My pistol's gone. My sword, too. All the spears have disappeared. Both my knives have disappeared into thin air. No matter. The horses will trample them to death. The horses are gone too, Raja. A thousand curses. Let us proceed. I am Greek Karate Master from Kyoto. Bye-bye. <laughs> Now it's your turn, White Raja. Prepare to meet your maker, Sandokan. Marty, here I am. Hurry, man. <laughs> you 
You have foiled my plans long enough, Sandokan. Yes, thanks to Chen Hu. But now we have to finish them off. Your enemies are defeated, Sandokan. Let them go. You will have plenty of other opportunities to unmask the White Raja. What are you going to do with them? Oh, there is much work waiting for the Red Dragons. Plowing, harvesting, rebuilding the houses they destroyed. Very good. Now Chen Yu can go back to his village. Will not our master stay with us in the monastery? Master is not needed. His pupils have learned wisdom. Sandokan has found his memory and his friends, and the fish are waiting for me in the Gulf of Tonkin. Goodbye and good luck, my friends! <laughs> <laughs>